It is 402 here and there are still plenty of questions this morning in the small town of Delphi. Last night, as we mentioned, police served that search warrant at a home on Bicycle Bridge Road near the Wabash River. Uh, you know, what we can tell you this morning, this all started on Monday when the parents of these two young girls reported them missing. Sure, and of course there have been so many questions, uh, new information. Matt McCutcheon there. Uh, doing some digging for us this morning. He is live with the reason investigators went to that house in the first place. Good morning, Matt. Ben and Julia, good morning. This wraps up a week of a little bit of information trickling out slowly here in this case, but still the big question remains about who killed those girls and why. We know very little information about what happened here at this home in rural Delphi, but we do know investigators came here around 7 o'clock last night and there were several of them. Video shows the scene as police not just from the city and the county here, but also Indiana State Police, even the FBI were told making the scene here last night as they started of that investigation into the home. At this hour, there is no word on any arrests in this case. The police did spend several hours here. We do know at least collecting evidence, and that evidence is related somehow in this case, but police are keeping that information close to the vest because at this hour, they do not want that to jeopardize the investigation. Also, police are not releasing the name of the person who lives here, and they also are not saying if this is the man they have so desperately wanted to get in contact with after circulating that picture. So again, questions continue here. This Friday morning, wrapping up a week of questions in this case, but police say they continue to remain on it and remain sorting through hundreds of tips they have received since this story broke on Monday. Now, we do expect more information here in the day ahead. Of course, we'll keep you posted here on air and online. For now, reporting live in Delphi, I'm Matt McCutcheon, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. Okay, Matt, thank you so much. Now, if you were in that area that day or you know anything about this case, please still want to hear from you. There is actually a new tip line you can call if you know anything that could help in this murder investigation. You see the number right there on your screen. We also have it posted for you to WTHR.com and our WTHR News app. Keep in mind, you can remain anonymous. And the Delphi community now preparing to say goodbye to Libby and Abby. That's right. There's a visitation for those girls tomorrow. It's from 4 to 8 at Delphi Community High School. Following the service, people can stay for a lantern release in the girls' honor.